All right, well, here goes nothing. Uh, so last night I did put the Zimbo Replenishing Rich Moisturizer on my face. Um, I did have a bit of like a tingly, itchy feeling along here, but it only lasted a short period of time. Other than that, I've had no issues or anything. As far as the bumps that were here the other day from the CeraVe, well, uh, there's still little tiny ones there, but it's not bothersome or anything. So I am going to try and uh, do this whole thing again. So the advice I was given was wash my face with warm water, do the CeraVe, rinse it off, and then put the moisturizer on. So that's the plan, Stan. <laughs> Okay, so my face is rinsed and now I'm going to put this on and I'll read the instructions again. Massage cleanser into to skin in a gentle circular motion. bit more for my forehead. All right, I think I got everywhere. So I'm going to rinse this off and then I will put on the moisturizer. Okay, face all rinsed off. Put the moisturizer on. I managed to get water all over me here. I don't know if you can see the two-tone color look here going on, but a little bit extra for my forehead. You know what? That's there. I'm checking in on your mom. Uh -oh. I think I got too much again. Maybe I'll just do my hands or something. I don't know you do, but you can see it on my eyebrows. So I don't know if you can see the progress on my lips. Like they still look kind of dry, but they feel so much smoother. And I'm just going to dry off my, not dry off, but like rub off the lotion here. So I'm going to open my Bird's Bee Lippy Balm. So while the appearance still looks kind of chapped, it's definitely a lot smoother. I'm not noticing dry skin. So that's helping. So yeah, I'm gonna, you know, rock out this moisturizer after using um, the cleanser and see if I get the bumps and itching again. If I do, then I guess we have to assume that it is the cleanser and that I should try something different. So we'll see how that goes.